Hello, welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoyed today's video. It's another of my witches. This is number three in my series of six witches, and she's a little more mature, or appears more mature, maybe teenagerish. Uh, even that's a bit of a trick because I think she might be very ancient and only appearing to be a teenager. You might notice there's a lot of detail in this particular witch. A lot of pattern on her dress, on her boots. She has more spiders than usual and at least three ghosts. One of them you can see right through to the um, tombstone. And she's got bats and a cat. So she's got all the witch accoutrement, including her broomstick. I started off with my drawing on tracing paper. I added a great deal of the detail after I'd finished the painting, so you don't see it here. I transferred my drawing to 140 pound watercolour paper, which I tear and tape the edges of so that I get a nice white border with a decal edge. And um, I just made my choices of colours at this point. I decided I didn't want her all dressed in black. I wanted a black cloak because I felt that would be dramatic. But I made her dress a combination of purple and orange. And I put in as many orange bits as I could because I thought it would brighten the picture. I didn't do any highlight or shadow. I leave it up to the pen to put in those things. Uh, and I don't think I even did it much with a pen. And I didn't do a huge amount of detail at this point. I know it looks like a lot, but it got even more. Using my pen, I added more spiders. I added stars and moons, half moons to the cloak. I added little hearts to the boots. I don't know why hearts, but there you go. And I firmed up all my lines because I found that the the paint sort of made them a little faint. Using my pen, I added a lot of weeds and scrubbiness to the foreground. And um, I think I added more spiders at this point. I may have done it earlier. I think she's looking like a strong, powerful witch at this point. I think she's got it all together. She's got um, evidence of her power in all the spiders and the bats and the um, fancy clothing. Yeah, she's a good witch. Well, I, she might not be a good witch, but she's a powerful witch, let's say that. Well, here's the painting finished and stored in my journal. And I'm very pleased with this one. I like this one better than the previous two. And I've got two more to work with. So we'll see how those come along. And um, if you enjoyed the video, please try and take time to um, like, share and subscribe. Liking and subscribing is the most important thing, I believe. Um, it does help my channel grow. And I want to say a big thank you to everyone who's already done that. That is so helpful. And I'm very, very grateful that you took the time to do that. And I'll see you next time. I've got two more witches. As... Uh, three more witches, as I said, and um, I might do some other thing in between that. I've got some other things brewing in my head. I'm not sure what, but I'll see you next time. And thank you very much for watching.